Hello guys, this is JT Gravity RC. Welcome back to my channel. I've just got the um, liftoff flight simulator for my PC and also my Apple Mac. But I'm going to show you in this video how to set up your Devo 7E and Devo 10 to play liftoff. When I got lift off yesterday I was looking around for model ini and I couldn't find anything and there was some discussion about on YouTube how to connect Devo 70 and Devo 10 with um, audio cable and uh, you have to download some kind of software called S Pro Pro or NV joystick or something like that so I decided not to do that. I, I wanted to try to see if I can use a USB cable for the Devo 10 and Devo 7E. So I looked around and I found a model you need for Devo 7E from the RC Groups forum. So I decided to test that and it actually works. So let me show you the model you need. Don't worry about the channel 3, 59%. That's fine. The model in is for liftoff and is created by somebody in RC group forum. So I'm going to put the link down my video and you can go and download your model in And please say thank you to the person who actually uh, giving the model in on RC group. So let me enter this and let, you sh and let me show you model in model setup. And I go to mixer. Hang on. And he he uses he uses all the simple curve for for the um, model in e. and I'm not sure what's inside here so offset 50 50 but anyway um, if you know more about how to set up throttle curve and stuff like that you should be able to work it out yourself when you get the model you need so don't worry about this 63 percent but make sure that after you install the model you need you have to uh, use the trim right trim button to center the trim because once when you um, uh, put it on your Devo 7 the trim is way up to here so your quad tends to drift to the left so I found that out and then I put the trim right in the middle so it's fine now so what you need to do when you want to set up your Devo 7 with your lift off is you go to option you go to control control presets And I use the um, manual creation. You just click on manual creation. And then you center all your joysticks. And then you just click calibrate. And then what you need to do, you need to do this. Do the circle. After a while, It says your calibration is done. So click next. So what you need to do, you need to uh, move the throttle stick and see which channel is receiving the signal. So this is Joy 1A Sys1. So what you can do is you need to click on this and then you need to try it, see where it works. Up, down, up, down. If it doesn't work, you need to invert the channel. So now that this is set, we go to the next one. So go to next. So now let's set the uh, the yaw. So this is a this is the channel that we're receiving the signal. So you just click on that and then try it. Uh, it seems to be reversed. So what you need to do, you need to invert 
the channel so now it should be fine so now it's correct right it's right left it's left so now that's done let's go to the aileron state so move the state and see which one up and down see which one is receiving the signal so it's this one so click on that and test it pitch forward pitch back pitch forward pitch back that's correct so let's click next so now we set the row so this one is receiving the signal so click on that and test it it seems to be reversed so you need to invert so now it's working correctly so once this is done you click next and then don't click anything else it's mode 2 that's fine so click next and then you, you just need to type in whatever name that you want to give to this one just say um, Devo 7E maybe here you put uh, also Devo 7E in the mode it's mode 2 save once it is safe, it will be recorded as this, Devo 70. So now you're all done. So what you need to do now is you click back, save and exit, and you're ready to play. So let's go to free flight. <coughs> excuse me. This is the easiest <coughs> excuse me scene. Uh, level because it doesn't have much obstacles so let's click on that and we'll start loading so what you need to do is you need to push the throttle stick up uh, hang on it's already um that's fine it's in at the moment this is early access uh, edition so you can't change much of the um, settings like this is acro mode i don't think you can do stabilize i try to find okay Hang on, let me just reset. I think the control is not correct right is right left is right the yo is wrong oh i think i think i know what's happening so let me go to inside the mixer see if i can reverse this on here let me see reverse okay let me try this now oh no right, that's wrong The yo is reversed, so 
Let me try it, right? Yeah, it's fine now. So once you set it up for your Devo 7e, you don't have to do it again for Devo 10. So let me show you that. I unplug this. I plug the Devo 10 in. Turn it on. With the same model. It works.
Anyway, guys, so um, this shows that you can set up your model ini for Devos 10 and Devos 70 to work with lift top with just a USB cable. All right. Please like and subscribe to my channel. I'll see you next time. Cheers.